Hi, this is Michael Williams, and we're going to be looking at eight reasons why we're shy. How do you overcome shyness? Well, one of the first things that we have to do is look at the source or the sources of our shyness. So in this series, we're going to have eight videos and they'll be relatively short. We're going to be looking at eight reasons, eight common reasons why people are shy. Now, I may not cover the reason why you or someone that you know is shy and I encourage you to share that in the comments. However, we're going to be looking at eight common reasons and these reasons are not in any hierarchy or any priority but we are going to start out with this one and the first reason that I want to look at is this. When someone is raised in an environment where they're discouraged from taking risks or chances, they may grow up being shy. Makes sense. So if a person is raised in an environment where they're discouraged from taking risks or chances, they may become shy. And when I talk about risks or chances, I'm not talking about crazy things, things that haven't been thought out, things where the repercussions haven't been thought out. Now for some people, uh, something that's crazy may be very sane to another. Jumping out of an airplane, climbing a mountain may be very sane to one person and crazy to another. We're not necessarily talking about that. We're talking about when someone does something they haven't thought through the repercussions of it, right? So what is it that perhaps has happened in your environment or who is it in your upbringing who may have discouraged you from stepping out, from trying new things, from taking advantage of opportunities. It could have been a parent, could have been a teacher, could have been friends. It could have been perhaps our response to our circumstances. We'll talk about that. It could have been relationships that we had, a previous partner, spouse, husband, boyfriend, girlfriend, whatever. All right, so when we are raised, right, or when we grow up or we live even, in an environment, and listen to this, we live in an environment where we're discouraged from taking risks, chances, or taking advantage of opportunities, we can become shy. We can live in a state of shyness. We can have a sense of shyness. What are we really talking about? We're talking about having a sense, of, a low sense of self-confidence, right? Growing up afraid of things, afraid of doing things, afraid of talking to people, afraid of going out and meeting people, afraid of doing this or doing that. So one of, one of the reasons, one of the sources of our shyness could be our upbringing, our previous environment. Does that make sense? Understanding this then, what I'd like to challenge you to do is to take a look at that and say, huh, is this one of my sources? of shyness, things that have happened to me in the past. Now, I'm not asking you to do anything about it. Just take a look at it, survey it, and say, huh, maybe it's because of previous relationships, maybe it's because of my parents, or maybe it's because of something else that I'm not willing to take the kinds of chance, or that I don't have the kind of confidence that I need. All right? So in the next video, we're going to look at a second reason, or a second source for our shyness. Thank you very much for joining me. I look forward to seeing you in the next video. This is Michael Williams.